Well, good morning, folks. I know you've been sitting down and laying down. You've been watching movies. You've been reading. You've been doing whatever, and you're getting bored. So we're going to do a little aerobics. I guess I'm going to have to do them sitting down so I won't get out of the screen here. Uh, but anyway, we're going to do a little aerobics this morning. It's called gospel aerobics. Uh, so if, I don't know if you've ever done gospel aerobics, but I used to do this with my children uh, in church. And it's, it's, uh, it's aerobics about Jesus. And it uh, starts off like this. It's the rock. Jesus is the rock. Are you ready? Are you ready? You have to follow me along. Now, here we go. Jesus is the rock of my salvation. The banner over me is love. Jesus is the rock of my salvation. The banner over me is love. Jesus is the rock of my salvation. The banner over me is love. The banner over me is love. You got it? He lifts me up to the banquet table. The banner over me is love. He lifts me up to the banquet table, the banner over me is love. He lifts me up to the banquet table, the banner over me is love. The banner over me is love. Now here's the fun one. One way to peace is the power of the cross, the banner over me is love. One way to peace is the power of the cross, the banner over me is love. One way to peace is the power of the cross. The banner over me is love. The banner over me is love. Now, we won't do that this morning, but I bet there are some uh, children listening and, uh, that sang this with me. And you remember what we did. I always got one person that would challenge me that he could do it or she could do it quicker than me. And we would go faster and faster and faster. One way to peace is the power of the cross. The banner over me is love. One way to peace is the power of the cross. The banner over me is love. One way to peace is the power of the cross. The banner over me is love. The banner over me is love. Yes, and I usually get beat by some young girl or guy. I let them win, you know. <laughs> Not. Okay. It's a Monday morning coming down. And we are ready to sing. We do have a banner. You know, that's a protection, a hedge of protection. And then, of course, they carried a banner into battle. And we still do that. I think we still take a flag. We call it a flag when we, uh, the, the banner. And so we have a banner. And let's uh, claim this banner with this old, uh, I don't even want to mention the word, but this the old crisis that's going on today. But we have a banner over us and it's love of Christ. Good old soul stuff. Okay, this is a, this is a young folks kid song and uh, you can catch on to it pretty quickly if you don't already know it. So here, this is, let's see. Let's see if I can catch on to it. Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love. Love. Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. You know, this is one of those children's songs that kind of repeats, changes one word, but repeats so everybody can sing along. So you guys have already caught on to the first verse, but we're going to do it again, and then you're going to sing along with me, okay? Are we ready to roll? Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Thank Him, thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love. God is love. Love Him. Love Him. All ye little children. God is love. God is love. Love Him. Love Him. All ye little children. God is love. God is love. I see my Uncle Robert from Florida is tuning in. He 
he's uh, he'll be 93 in in uh, July, and he probably knew this song 92 years ago. <laughs> serve him, serve him, all ye little children. God is love. God is love. Serve him, serve him, all ye little children. God is love. God is love. Praise him, thank him, love him, serve him. That's what it's all about. That's that's what makes Christians happy when we do all those, when we praise him, when we love him, and when we serve him, when we thank him. And this is another praise, uh, just uh, kind of a medley of, of praise. And some of you will catch on to some of it. Hum along on the part you don't know and sing along on the part you do know. It goes like this. I just came to praise the Lord. I just came to praise the Lord. I just came to praise His holy name. I just came to praise the Lord. You know it by now. I just came to praise the Lord. I just came to praise the Lord. I just came to praise His name. I just came to praise the Lord. For He came into my life one very special day. He came into my heart to show me a better way. I just came to praise the Lord. Here we go. I just came to praise the Lord. Just want to let you know. I just came to praise the Lord. Jesus will never let you go. And I just came to praise His holy name. I just came to praise one we one reason that we praise him. I just feel like something good is about to happen. I just feel like something good is on its way. He has promised that he'd open all of heaven. And brother, it can happen any day. When God's people humble themselves and call on Jesus. And they look to heaven expecting as they pray. I just feel like something good is about to happen. And brother, this could be that very day. Well, I've read all the bad news in the paper. And it seems like things get bleaker every day. But for this child of God, it makes no difference. Cause I know it's gonna get better either way He has promised I no fear can hardly fathom All the things he has in store for those who pray I just feel like something good is about to happen And brother, this could be that very day Sing along! I just feel like something good is about to happen I just feel like something good is on its way He has promised that it open all of heaven And brother, it could happen any day When God's people humble themselves and call on Jesus And they look to heaven expecting as they pray I just feel like something good is about to happen And brother, this could be that very day I just feel like something good is about to happen And brother, this could be Sister, this could be Everybody, this could be that very day But we don't stop there Because then we sing Jesus is the answer For the world today Above him there's no Jesus is the way, Jesus is the answer for the world today, above him there's no other, Jesus is the way.
sing it. It's pretty simple. It's the Andre Crouch song. Jesus is the answer for the world today. Above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for the world today. Above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. That's the reason we sing. I just came to praise you, Lord. I just came to praise you, Lord. I just came to praise your holy name. I just came to praise. That's a pretty good medley. I, I, uh, just makes you kind of lifts you up, makes you feel good. Hey, all you people that are saying hi. <laughs> hey, there's old Frank Cooper. Frank, you might even know this next song. I bet you will. You probably play it on the mandolin. Uh, you know, gospel music, good old gospel music, which is what I do, what I like. It's uh, the original soul music. It was soul before. Uh, Motown came along and let me tell you I really like Motown matter of fact I have a requested song that's requested quite often uh, that's an old Motown song and uh, it was it was my favorite song growing up and when I was playing in a band and all that kind of stuff and uh, it, it talks about my girl well you know we, we took that song and we changed it to gospel by changing one word and so instead of saying my girl, we say my God. Now I know most of you that are listening and singing along can sing every word of this song. So please do. Uh, was my girl, now my God. Here we go. Let's try it.
saw some folks coming up on there that heard me sing that many many years ago wow that song's getting old that means i'm getting old speaking of old once again i'm wearing this cap that says 1952 i'm wearing this shirt that says the great rueville roast well folks i grew up outside of rueville and i went to rueville school Ru graduated from rueville high just if you figure, if you do your math, those of you who are in the top half of the class, you know that. Okay, born in 1952, that means I graduated in 1970, or they let me out in 1970. But anyway, guess what? We are celebrating in Ruleville this year our 50th uh, graduation anniversary. Wow, that's amazing! And I see some of you folks on there, so be sure to contact. Uh, me or get on get on the Facebook the 70s uh, Ruville High School 70s page and and make sure that we have your contact information because Ruville roast is when we do it well Ruville, Ruville Mississippi a lot of people think that's just a little old podunk Delta town and guess what it is but it's a wonderful podunk Delta town and they're way ahead of us uh, uh, us other folks and other schools because they've been doing this for years they have a Ruville roast and they do all kinds of stuff. Uh, the last uh, weekend in September, and, uh, and all of the classes, graduating classes, have their reunion at that time. Isn't that amazing? Even churches have reunions at that time. It's, a, it's just a really smart thing to do. And so we're having our reunion. And those of you who I see on here from Rueville, or, uh, uh, be sure to contact us, uh, Francis, Thompson told me to be sure to give a plug Frances Thompson uh, Trackler because she tro Troxler because she uh, she and Paula Morgan are kind of kind of heading this thing up because they were in the top of our class anyway uh, we're gonna have a reunion uh, we're gonna have a reunion in the sky one of these days and all of us are gonna be there and uh, we're gonna be singing a new music we're gonna be singing gospel music but even new stuff but while we're here we need to realize that our faith is built on nothing less than Jesus and his righteousness that's why I do this yeah, that's why I've been doing this for years you know and that's why I do this old-time gospel tour that I hope is gonna crank up whenever this virus is through if you ever need somebody to sing old-time gospel music and preach old-time gospel at your church just uh, get in touch with me give me a call uh, but times that we're going through right now and me being right here by this water reminds me of this song I think we might have already done it one time but we're gonna do it again man you, you guys are making me I'm seeing all this stuff on here where Eloise is saying my best childhood memories and Suzanne saying me too Eloise uh, yeah, yeah great childhood memories so that means you need to be there on the 50th anniversary and for you Suzanne that would be just, you're just a little behind us but you need to be there too anyway I digress <laughs> I shall not be, I shall not be moved, I shall not be, I shall not be moved just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be moved, that's one of those repeats, you know, I shall not be, I shall not be moved, I shall not be I shall not be moved just like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved. When my cross is heavy, I shall not be moved. When my cross is heavy, I shall not be moved just like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved. The church of God is marching. I shall not be moved. The church of God is marching. I shall not be moved just like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved. King 
Jesus is our captain, and I shall not be moved. King Jesus is our captain, and I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be moved. Come on and join the army, I shall not be moved. Come on and join the army, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be moved. Fighting sin and Satan, I shall not be moved. Fighting sin and Satan, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be moved. When my burdens weigh me down, I shall not be moved. When my burdens weigh me down, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be good one for today. Don't let the world deceive you, I shall not be moved. Don't let the world deceive you, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water, I shall not be moved. Even if my friends forsake me, I shall not be moved. Even if my friends forsake me, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water I shall not be moved Everybody I shall not be I shall not be moved I shall not be I shall not be moved Just like a tree That's planted by the water I shall not be moved Come on now I, I see a couple of you folks back there not singing Stand up and sing I shall not be I shall not be moved. I shall not be, I shall not be moved. Just like a tree that's planted by the water. Just like a tree that's planted by the water. Just like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved. Yep, we ain't gonna be moved. When we do get moved, we, we, the, they're going to the trumpet of the Lord's going to sound, and and the roll is going to be called up yonder. You know, there is going to be a roll call. You know, God keeps books. Matter of fact, I didn't really understand how God could keep all that stuff until these computers came along and started having all these gigabytes and megabytes and all these big big bytes, whatever they are. And now, you know, God knew about computers a long time before we did. Matter of fact, He probably uh, knows a well. Not probably. He knows a whole lot more than these computers can even do. He let us invent them. Ain't God good? Wow. So, but he is he is keeping up. And there's going to be a roll called up there one of these days. And uh, the Christians are going to be raptured, taken up there to be with him. And we're going to sit before the judgment seat of Christ. Now, the Greek word is bima there, the bima seat of Christ. And we're going to stand before the bima seat of Christ. And guess what the Bema seat was back in the, the old Roman and Greek days and stuff like that. It was when uh, the runners of the race would run and then they would all go up to the Bema seat and they would receive their rewards, whether it be a, a blue ribbon or a pink ribbon or whatever it may be. I don't know what they used back then. They used these, uh, these holly crowns or whatever kind of... Uh, plant that was you know and they would receive those and they would be winners and then every everybody you know I don't know if everybody got a trophy or not but anyway they would go to the Bema seat so guess what if you have put your faith and trust in Christ you're gonna stand before this Bema seat and the amazing thing about it is God's gonna say you know what buddy you know what Mickey your sins have been washed away you may not deserve to come into my heaven but my son, Jesus, died on the cross, and he put your sins in that cup on that cross, and your sins died with him. So you you get to just get these rewards, and he opens that computer up and says, hmm, look at this, man. Look at all these rewards you're going to get. And uh, I don't know about you, but I'm going to be pretty excited about it. I don't care if I just get one reward, but uh, 
I, I'm, I'm working on more than that. I remember old Bud Burrell telling me one time in Sunday school, he said, oh, I just want, I just want to fall over the, the gate in heaven. And I said, Mr. Burrell, I don't want to just fall over the gate, man. I want to jump that gate or run through that gate, and I want to receive me some rewards. But anyway, we're going to be at the Bema Seat of Christ. Sad news is, those who don't believe have another judgment. And I'm not going to go into that. It'll scare you to death. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe some of you need to be scared tomorrow. But today, when a roll is called up yonder, I'll be there. When the trumpet of the Lord shall sound and time shall be no more And the morning breaks eternal bright and fair When the saved of earth shall gather over on the other shore And the roll is called up yonder, I'll be there when the roll is called up yonder, 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 I'll be there. I know one person singing with me. I see her name on there, Emily Curry Smith. <laughs> you better sing every word, girl, and do it right. When the chosen one shall gather over on the other shore And the beauty of his resurrection shall I forgot the words When the beyond the sky That's it When the roll is called up yonder I'll be there Don't laugh Tommy Thompson You don't know the words to this When the roll is called up yonder When the roll is called up yonder It's called up yonder When the roll is called up yonder I'll be there Let us labor for the master From the dawn till setting sun Let us talk of all his wondrous love and care And when all of life is over And our work on earth is done And the roll is called up yonder I'll be there When the When the roll is called up yonder, 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 I'll be there. And while we're down here, I shall not be, I shall not be moved, I shall not be. I shall not be moved just like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved. Well, kind of, it's, it's almost quitting time. But I see people still joining in. Hey, Amy Hatchet Bowling. Hadn't seen you forever. But I know at Holly Bluff Baptist Church, they did this song. It's our closing song. It's our theme song. Well, some glad morning, when this life is over, I'll fly away to a home on God's celestial shore. Of a home for 
I'm born again. Are you born again? If you're not born again, you will not enter into heaven to stand before the Bema Seat of Christ. And here's what's amazing. I was talking to a friend of mine from Bernie, Texas yesterday, and we agreed. She grew up Catholic. I grew up Baptist. She's not Catholic now, but anyway, we, uh, we agreed that the only way, the only way to get into those gates is through Jesus Christ because God said so. That, you know, people say, well, you know, the Bible said it. Uh, I believe it. That settles it. Nah, the Bible said it. That settles it whether you believe it or not. And the only way, one way to Christ, one way to heaven is through Jesus Christ. It just don't get no better. Let's see. Merle Haggard actually did a song. I probably can't remember it, but the chorus went something like this. There's just one way to make that trip to glory. Well, God so loved the world and sent his son. So lift your fingers to the sky. When you die, there's just one way to make that final run. It's not very brave or smart to end a a session with a song that you can't remember. But anyway, I'm hoping and praying that old Merle Haggard is going to be there and we're going to sing a little Merle even for Jesus. You guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for uh, tuning in. Uh, you can you can catch it on YouTube. Uh, one of my buddies, Simon DeSoto, puts it on YouTube. You can catch all of this on YouTube. And The good thing about this is if you just get sick and tired of listening to me, you can cut it off. You can fast forward, you can whatever, but I am so glad that you tune in and you sing along with the old time gospel music. Uh, God loves you, and I'm trying really hard. Actually, I do. So you guys have a great day. God bless.